Hello. So I just got myself a set of art supplies, which I am really excited about. This is for doing tiny little artworks. Part of that is unrelated. But this is the front that we are looking at. This is a tabletop easel. Let's zoom in a little. Tabletop easel with canvas set. So these are delightful to do. If you're used to doing larger size art, this is a nice challenge for you to think outside of the box. And also in terms of making art that is accessible, a lot of people can't find the space to do giant artwork or to have giant work in their house. But these are nice and small. You can see the size there is manageable. And here, let's open one of these up. So we've got 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 of them in total. Get the plastic wrap off of this so we can show you what an actual one looks like. So these are two separate things. You've got the canvas, which is glued to the edge of this wood frame. So you've got a wood frame and then a piece of canvas, which is glued on all four sides. And then you've got the little easel. This does articulate. So you set this up at whatever distance you want. Here, let's put this down. So you set that up on the table. And then you set your little piece of art onto it. So in terms of presentation, it looks like a painting sitting on an easel. So I wouldn't paint it on this because you'd have a risk of getting the paint on the edges of the wood. But I would paint it on a flat surface, you know, a piece of paper or a newspaper or something else so that the paint doesn't get on anything else. And then when the item is dry, then I would prop it up on this for display purposes. So that's a really cute little project. You know, on one hand, this is fun for kids, but kids might have a lot of trouble working on something this small unless they're doing a fairly abstract kind of design. For adults, this is a lot of fun because it is a real challenge to be able to do something at that tiny size, even if you did a flower or a, you know, a simple um, water landscape kind of scene. So in general, it is very cute three by three inches for the canvases, five inch mini easels. And I am going to have a lot of fun with this and we'll do projects with my local art group to be able to let multiple people give this a shot. So highly recommend it and I will uh, update my review once I get some of these actually painted to let you know how the process goes.